I'm Luke Stanton here from BendyWeagles.com with our student athlete spotlight. And this week with me, we have men's baseball player Tim Hendricks. Tim, thanks for coming on. It's a pleasure to be here, Luke. <laughs> so, uh, are you, how's the semester going? Is it? I know it's starting to get close to finals and everything. So, mm -hmm. are you finishing strong? Are you hanging in there? Let me tell you something, uh, Luke. It is Luke, right? Yes. All right. Um, I, I am just told you. In there. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> that's my fault. But uh, you know what? I am hanging in there, uh, trying to do well uh, mentally, physically. And emotionally. It's good to hear. Good to hear. Good to hear you're hanging in there. Thank you. Um, so, recently, the teams had a lot of games get canceled and moved because mm -hmm. of the weather. It's been kind of a rough spring, Mother Nature wise. So, right. is that kind of tough to get in the rhythm as a team with you know games getting moved and everything like that? Yeah, I mean, uh, all we've been doing is practicing indoors lately. Uh, it gets kind of boring and stuff, but it's part of the game, and, uh, you know, we're just trying to hang in there. So you had a good summer playing ball at a college league out in Massachusetts. Yeah. You hit really well out there. So how was that experience? Was that good to play against some really good competition like that? Yeah, it was great to play. In, uh, we were, I had kids from University of Florida on my team, uh, Baylor. Uh, what really struck me was the Boston accent out there. Uh, <laughs> yeah. You know, go Sox, stuff like <laughs> that. Uh, went to Fenway, uh, sat on the Green Monster. It was, uh, it was pretty sweet. This season you had a lot of responsibility, Ed, as you're the leadoff hitter on the team now. You're... Uh, playing center field, he kind of took over the role that Dan Zust had last year. So, right. have you have you been able to have so much success while taking on such bigger responsibility? You know what, Luke? I wake up in the morning and I uh, I stick to this one acronym, uh, D bad. Okay, don't be a doofus. Okay, <laughs> I try to wake up in the morning, think to myself, don't be a doofus today. That's all I live <laughs> my life. Uh, you could substitute the last D, Dumbo, Dummy. Don't, I, I like don't be a doofus. Uh, kids out there, America. Don't be a doofus. <laughs> so that's what you kind of have to remember yes. when you're out in the field. Just mm -hmm. make sure you make sure you be yourself. Don't be a doofus. Yeah. Don't be a doofus. That's good. I guess that's sound advice to have right there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, so you also you have your brother on the team, right? Uh, Kevin, mm -hmm. what's it like playing ball with your brother in college? Well, uh, his nickname is the Felon, uh, Kevin the Felon Hendricks. Uh, he likes to uh, you know bust some chops and stuff like that. But uh, it's kind of cool playing with him in left field. Uh, we we rag on each other from time to time. Do you have any conversations throughout the game with your brother, both out there in the outfield? Yeah, uh, we like to sing songs in the outfield. Uh, we, we like to have a good time. We keep it, we keep it tight. That's that's <laughs> what we say. We keep it tight. So it's kind of like a little little concert out there. Huh? Yeah, mm -hmm. me, John, kind of, kind of is the felon. Yeah, we like we like keeping it real. So uh, I'm in the off season. You and I think it was Steve Koch that did the mm -hmm. uh, uh, internet video. It's called Pick Your uh, Team. Yes. You want to talk about that a little bit? Well, uh, it's the greatest internet show out there right now. Uh, it's been. Uh, I believe uh, Forbes magazine has it on top 100 <laughs> list for uh, internet shows out there. It's actually me. Uh, my name is uh, Tim Viper Hendricks on the show, mm -hmm. and uh, it was TJ the Wasp Floyd was also on it with me, and we had a segment called Ask Chomp, and that's Steve Cokehead. Mm -hmm. uh, we pick the games each week. It's mostly for NFL. Uh, it could be for anything really. It's it's known as the greatest show uh, hands down, and uh, <laughs> you know I I can't disagree with the critics, right? <laughs> That's true. Uh, what's your what's your major? What are your plans to do with that at the Benedict? I mean, well, it sounds like you could have a pretty good broadcasting career with the yeah. Tick Your Team video. Well, um, yeah, let's pick your team, not pick your team. Um, but oh, okay, my bad. Yeah, gotta get right. that right. It's all right. Um, but what uh, what are my plans are? I'd like to play baseball. Continue further, mm -hmm. obviously. That's number one. But I do have a communications major right now, so I, I'd actually like to work with like films and stuff like that. But uh, hopefully, baseball works out though. That's what I want. Yeah, well, it seems like with the with the Picky O team videos and everything, it seems like you got a bright future in broadcasting. Yeah, so ES I think we'll do good. ESPN's either way. like contacted us already. We had to turn them down because uh, they're not ready for that just yeah, yet. Yeah, obviously not. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. uh, do you have a favorite baseball player or like a role model in the major league yeah. that you look up to? At all? Uh, Josh Hamilton's my favorite baseball player. I read his book. He's a great story. And uh, Robinson Cano is also another one. One of my favorites. He's got the best swing in baseball. That was uh, the very uh, energetic and colorful Tim Hendricks this week for uh, uh, student Tim, athlete Tim spotlight. Viper Hendricks. Tim Viper Hendricks, mm -hmm. that's right. So that was Tim Viper Hendricks this week for student athlete spotlight. I'm Luke Sanzik from BenjaminWeagles.com.